some students studying with ACE 5 and 6 will be taking external exams. They may be taking Cambridge English Flyers, Ket or Pet for Schools or Trinity Speaking exams. The combination of course material for ACE, including the exams booklet, is aligned to the grammar and vocabulary syllabus of these exams. There's also an exams practice CD-ROM to help you further prepare students. In all of the external exams I've mentioned, there's a section where the children need to give personal information about themselves. ACE 5 and 6 provide plenty of opportunity for the children to practice exchanging personal information. In addition, the preparation of a class presentation in each Lesson 11 means that the children practice talking about many different areas of their lives in detail. The KET and PET speaking exams also require students to talk to another candidate as well as the examiner. For this reason, you'll find all the opportunities which ACE provides for pair and group speaking practice very useful. Developing skills for using functional language is important for these sections of the exams and Lesson 7 in every unit teaches the children to use this language appropriately. The fluency cards at the back of the activity book also provide lots of pair speaking practice. At the same time, they prepare students for information gap activities, which are a feature of the Flyers speaking examination in particular. Describing pictures is another feature of the external exams and again ACE provides practice for this, particularly in lesson 8 of each unit where the children compare three photos each time. In the Flyers exam, describing pictures also includes an aspect of storytelling which you'll also find practice for in ACE. For further information about how ACE prepares children for the other papers in the external exams, please watch the videos Preparing for External Exams Listening and Reading and Writing Skills in ACE 5 and 6.